What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about the future of Diablo 4. Considering we saw some postings for jobs from Rob Ferguson that looks like they're going to be spending a lot of time with Diablo 4 going into the future. Before I get into all the details, be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course, if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, I hope you consider subscribing. Usually when you see uh, companies start posting jobs for a game that was just released, that's usually a good sign, kind of saying that they're going to have a lot of content coming to the game in the future. There's a lot of different job postings. I'm going to have them listed here from Twitter where they listed everything they're hiring for, so you can kind of see them on screen. But you have things from producers to game producers to live operations to the season producers, things, uh, software engineers, um, you know, art design, all that kind of stuff. So that really shows that Blizzard is really dedicated to Diablo 4. Now, this was the fastest selling game that Blizzard has ever had. So Diablo 4 was the fastest selling game out of every game that, or everything that Blizzard has really done. So that says a lot. That shows you how many people were interested in Diablo 4, kind of from the get-go. And of course, those numbers came out fairly quickly. That was like right during the early access to actual launch day phase. So they sold a lot of copies, even in early access. And with all these different jobs posting, uh, or all the different jobs they have posted, it's showing that they're wanting to continue to work on the game in general. They already said they already had the first couple seasons in the works, but this shows you they're already looking to probably start working on expansions for you know yearly content, maybe a big expansion each year, and continue to work on seasons and seasonal content. So they're having to hire pretty much everybody for everything that you could imagine that would work you know within these or within what they're wanting to do for these things so it really looks like we could have some good things coming down the road for diablo 4 and i know a lot of people are kind of curious exactly what's going to happen you know from season to season a lot of people are really looking forward to season one and kind of see what kind of content we're going to have what kind of you know battle pass cosmetic system you're going to have um all that kind of stuff so it looks like Blizzard is definitely dedicated to, to Diablo 4 uh, for the foreseeable future. We'll kind of have to wait and see what happens down the road. I know people are, are, are will come and go playing games. So, you know, new things may come out. People may go play that for a while. Some people may get tired of the grind in Diablo. And you know, a lot of RPG, MMO style games, people get kind of tired of that grind after a while. But overall, I think you'll see a lot of new players come into the game going forward and you'll probably see a lot of returning players coming back after them maybe they take a break for a little while and i think that's what blizzard is looking at as kind of as a whole they're, they're going to see the community as kind of evolving you'll have your veteran players that are going to stay around for a long time as long as the game is out you'll have new players coming in and returning players so they're trying to set this game up for the future to make sure that they have good content that everyone can enjoy so leave me a comment with your thoughts and i'll catch you all next time peace